guys, welcome back to a brand new video on the Slough Town Vlogs channel. It's been so long since we've done one of these like sit down prediction videos. It's kind of crazy. A little bit of a new setup as well. But I hope you're all staying safe. I'm travelling down to Concord Rangers tomorrow as we take them on in the National League South. I've got my predictions for that game and all of Game Week 20 are coming your way. So make sure you hit a like. And subscribe and enjoy the Starting video. off with the predictions because I know that's why most of you are all here. We're going to start off with game week 20 with Bath versus Ebbsfleet. Um, when we played Ebbsfleet a few weeks ago, I weren't actually that impressed with them. But um, I reckon they have a little bit more quality than Bath. And that's why I'm going 2-1 Ebbsfleet in that one. Moving on now to Billericay versus Welling. I'm going to go for a 1-0. I think it's got 1-0 written all over that game. And yeah. Braintree versus Chippenham. Um, Slough played Braintree Tuesday, losing 1 0. And Braintree on their home turf, you know, I'd back them every day. And that's why I'm going to go Braintree 1, Chippenham 0. Moving on now to the game that all the Slough fans are here for um, it's Concord versus Slough. And I'm going to go for 2-1 Slough. If you're not already following me on Twitter, I'm sure there'll be a link in the description below. I've gone for a Tyler Goodrum brace and Slough to win 2-1. That's my prediction. I'm sorry to all the Concord fans, but that's what I am going for. Now, Dartford versus Dorking. I think that's got to be the one that most eyes are on. But Dorking announced this week that Matt Briggs, probably one of their star players this season with Alfie Rutherford, is now out with an ACL. I think he ruptured it and he's out for nine months. So all the best to Briggsy. I think he was on like, he was at Slough at some point. I think, I think, I'm pretty sure that happened. But I'm still saying 3 1 Dorking in that one. Um, not because I have, uh, I speak to uh, Mark White quite a lot of Dorking. I just think Dorking, well, they're going to go up, aren't they? If they don't, then they bottled it. <laughs> I'm sorry, but they've, they've, they've definitely bottled it. Eastbourne versus St Albans. It's the South Coast versus Hertfordshire. And I'm going to go 2 1 St Albans in that one. I think it's just, I've read, ugh, it's predictions. And I know not everyone's going to agree with me on predictions. So, you know, I always get one person, you know, commenting or like tweeting me or sending me a message on Facebook saying how we're going to smash them, we're going to smash them. This is predictions. You're never going to agree with me on my predictions. Hampton versus Dulwich, um, a London derby, I believe. Um, West London versus South London. I've gone for 1 1 in that one. Haven versus Chelmsford now. I think that's going to be an exciting one. But I'm going to go for 2 all, 2 um, 2 all, just 2 all, um, <laughs> two, <laughs> 2 to both of them, I guess. Um, Haven versus Chelmsford. I'm going to go for 2 all in that one. I think that's a fair result. Um, Haven getting a draw with Slough. I think Chelmsford's around that area, if I'm remember correctly Maystone versus Hungerford two decent sides this year you know Maystone are pushing to catch up to Dorking but I think they've guaranteed a playoff spot now um, so I think they're just trying to get more points on the board and that's why I'm going to go it's going to be a tight one because Hungerford do have good burgers Not it don't relate to the football uh, but I know there was a passing at Hungerford Town. I can't actually remember. I think it was their president. So all my wishes go out to you guys at Hungerford. Uh, but I'm going to go for a 3 2 Maidstone in that one. I think that's going to be a fair result. And the final um, game this week is Oxford versus Tombridge. And I'm going for a 2 1 Oxford win there. Oxford were very dom dominant at the start of the year. But I think that, you know, they've, they've dropped down a little bit. But I still think they're going to beat Tombridge Angels. Thanks everyone for watching this video. I've really enjoyed filming this. If you want to see more prediction videos or more sit down videos or like maybe interviews with players, bring back um, Slough's Finest podcast, let me know. I've been Slough Town Vlogs and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.